So in this video we'll talk about how to charge your battery for the best performance so it does not lose its capacity. So first thing to know is that there are two ways to charge your bike. The first one is here on the power slot. You can put your charger here and the battery will charge and you will be able to see the level of the battery here on the display. And the second way is on the battery you can take it off and put the charger here at this charging port. So now that you know how we can charge the battery, uh, let's talk about what to keep in mind when to charge it for best performance. First of all, this uh, port on the charger and also the port in the, for the battery are magnetized and sometimes they know to attach small metal pieces that are almost not visible to the eye and uh, when that happens it might cause closed circuit damage to the battery or the whole system so before you charge the battery always take a look at the charging port and if you see any dust any scrap metal you can clean it out we'll show you that in another video so if you have checked the battery the ports the connectors then all is clean then you can go to the charging so when to charge the battery of course we would all want to charge it to the 100 percent and then drop it to the zero and then charge it again that is okay if you do it a couple of times but in the long term it will cause the battery capacity to lower or maybe the cells to damage so what we recommend is that when you see that your bike will be near zero percent that you do not allow it to drop to zero but to charge it before it gets to that and also to not not to charge it to 100 percent every time so if some it gets to 95 96 97 then just take the charger off and that will in long term help to preserve the cells and the battery's health also always use the charger you have been given with the battery and the bike and keep in mind the instructions that are written on the label of the charger there are also a few other things to keep in mind the battery should always be charged in the room temperature between 5 degrees celsius and 40 degrees celsius so if the conditions are where you are stationed are not within that temperature range don't charge the battery charge it when you get to a place where the temperature is like that what else to keep in mind um. so recommendation is to choose the the way of charging the battery by taking it off and directly charging the battery itself because it is faster it will charge faster and also it is better for the battery if you are charging the battery while it is on the bike then what we often see and what we recommend you not to do is to put, keep the bike in standby mode and then put the charger on there is absolutely no need for the bike to be turned on while the charging process is, is on because it will do nothing good for the bike and it just might might uh, cause some some issues uh, the next thing is you might ask when i charge the bike uh, the battery through the bike i can see the percentage here on the screen yes that is correct but we have an indicator of the battery capacity in some other way so in the newer batteries that were sent out after the february of 2020 we have a led light you can see right here and when you put the charger here the battery is charging the color of the led light indicates the level of the battery that is currently available so the red light is from 0 to 25 percent the 
orange light is for 25 to 50%, yellow light 50 to 75, and if the LED light color is green, that means that it's between 75 and 100%. So there's also a LED light indicator on the charger. Before putting it on, as I mentioned, always check the connectors, the pins, and the connector of the charger, make sure there's no dust, there's no little scrap metal objects. I mentioned it earlier, if there's something is in here, it might cause errors, which might lead to the damage to the battery, the whole bike, and to the charger also. So, when your charger is plugged in into the jack, but it haven't been plugged to the battery, this red light indicates that it is working properly that it is ready and will charge the battery. So the green light, while the charger still isn't plugged in, means that it's working properly and it's ready for the charging. When you put the charger to the battery, you can see now that the color has changed to the red. When it's red, that means that the battery is being charged. If in any case you notice that this red light is blinking, that means there, there is an error. It might be caused by scrap metal and dust we talked about, or by something else. If you notice that, take it off, clean it, and then try again. If it still persists, then you can always contact your great retailer. They will then contact us and we'll see what, what, what might be the issue.